Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Um, it's a beautiful um, Friday morning here in uh, Austin, Texas. Um, as always, I am filled with gratitude. I uh, just got in from a 12 mile run and uh, it was a really, really good run today, um, as I stated in my other video. Um, thoughts on the mind today. Um, it's Friday, man, it's Friday. It's, a, it's an amazing thing. Um, Generally, when I am on my runs, I normally um, am listening to music, listening to books, listening to podcasts and things of the sort. And I did do some of that today, um, but I took a while to just turn off everything and just kind of go in the mood and just run. Um, and it was it was really nice to kind of do the empty out the head and things of the sort. Um, actually, a story from my past popped up into my head and uh, it was interesting to think about it because... <sighs> It says so much about my life to a large degree. Um, back in high school, uh, my senior year of high school, I had decided to uh, try out for football. Uh, before that, I hadn't done it. I'd done track, um, I'd done soccer, and uh, I, I think those were what I was doing. Um, but my senior year, I was like, you know what? Let me go out for football. Um, I'd always played it, just pick up football, but I'd never played it on a team. Uh, honestly, part of it was just the fear um, and understanding that I didn't have, I knew I had the talent and the skill level, but I didn't have the, the, the discipline and the repetition that you need to be great, like in anything. And so I remember there was a gentleman I know, uh, Michael Scott, he was our lead running back, um, in high school. Um, he started from, he was started, he was a lead, uh, tailback from sophomore year to, um, our senior year. And um, he was also on the track team with me. We ran the four by 100 together. So I remembered, or I'd heard through the grapevine when I started out that um, Mike, who is actually an alderman now in, uh, in Chicago, man, a leader, a born leader. I'd heard through the grapevine that he was nervous about me going on a football field because he was nervous that I would take his uh, starting tailback position. Now, here's the funny thing about that. I'd never played tailback before. Um, I'd never, I didn't know, I didn't know the playbook. I didn't know any of these things, but this gentleman just of, off of us knowing each other from playing, running track was feel for of his job. Now, why I couldn't tell you, because here's the other side of that. I had my fears about it as well. And I didn't think I could live up to that example. But to some degree, it shows that someone believed in who, whatever, what talent I had or something that I had, that he was nervous enough about a job that he had held for three years to lose from me. And it's just a great example of even things that I'm dealing with in my lifetime now. It's like sometimes we put these ceilings on ourselves that other people don't see or may see or whatever. But start taking those ceilings off. And you can reach your ultimate goal if you really take the time. Get out of your head. Get out of your head. Get out of your head. Ron, get out of your head. Anyway, I'm almost done. It's about 3.30 and uh, 3.32 now. And I'm done for my planks getting on to the rest of my day. Have a blessed day today and every day. Peace.